This is lesson number six, painting tools in Photoshop. Uh, brush, pencil, color replacement, mixer brush, history brush, art history brush, gradient, paint bucket we are going to see. So Adobe Photoshop, uh, it uh, provides us uh, with a lot of uh, a variety of painting and image uh, editing tools. Uh, most of uh, the tools we have already seen, but uh, today we are going to pinpoint some tools from where or by which we are actually painting. So you can just preset thing or there are already default thing which are available. So healing brush tool this already we have seen we need to uh, see what it does I'll show you uh, what it actually does. So we have to first alt click take the area and then we can just go to the the area which has been selected to that point where for example you need to eliminate the wrinkles on a face say we have to choose that wrinkle free area of skin and then we need to work on it then patch tool patch tool is there are two methods so this if this is the say image then we can take a patch and we can just transfer this content here that is we have a source and a destination i'll show you how that is done then magic eraser tool how does it work uh, because we have various properties attributes which we can change tolerance contiguity and we can work on various layers the opacity then dodge tool and burn tool in order to lighten or in order to darken the area this also i'm going to tell you then the basic thing is uh, brush and pencil so brush and pencil this is a brush and this is a pencil these are the traditional drawing tool that we are going to use uh, and pencil is nothing but just one pixel brush to tool tip we can also do some color replacement if you want to change color of some, some particular part that's not a very professional way but for simple tasks you can perform it a mixer brush we have history brush we have then art history brush we have so this uh, mixer brush it creates a realistic painting technique like the mixing of colors on the canvas like uh, combining the colors on a brush and there are uh, you know you can paint or various wetness or stroke and this mixture brush uh, has two paint wells reservoir and pickup this reservoir stores the final color deposited onto the canvas and has more paint uh, capacity the pickup on the other hand this well receives paint only from the canvas and its content are continuously mixed with canvas colors the history brush the history brush because the name is history uh, the names comes from the uh, previous version so history brush tool uh, used this is used to apply an image area for from an from a different state or snapshot to your current state and if you use this tool uh, to restore a portion of an image to an earlier state by leaving the rest of the modified image uh, like that only so this we can use we can use art history brush also so this art history brush uh, is an interesting variation on the this plain old history brush tool so both of these tools paint over an image by using information from a previous state so this art history brush tool it employed includes various options also like the style the area and the tolerance then we have the gradient this gradient tool and paint bucket tool we have this uh, gradient tool creates a gradual blend between multiple colors and you can choose from uh, preset gradient fills you can create your own also so this uh, paint bucket also is there paint bucket you can just fill some area and this is the, the relation of the adjoining pixel that is exact area filled is determined by how similar each adjoining pixel is to the pixel you are clicked on right and you can change the tolerance value low value high value like this so let me show you all these uh, most of these we have already seen but just uh, in order to complete for the sake of completion of this uh, discussion let me open an image say baby image so what uh, we were trying to discuss we have already seen this now this brush tool is see i'm brushing and these these are various options which you can choose you know master diameter if I take diameter high, hardness high, you just see the difference. See, I can just take very normal and I can just draw like you are drawing on a piece of paper using a pencil. Then we have this pencil tool also. 
we have weather variation for this opacity etc so you can use this pencil tool like this right so it's a hard hard one rather than the previous one so this is the uh, these are the two tools which are basically uh, today's discussion point then we have history brush tool because we don't have any any history so we are not using it and uh, this art history also because it needs to have see it needs to have certain previous pre previous uh, uh, snapshot also so that it can take it because we don't have that is why i'm just showing that these are here you can just try it history brush tool and art uh, history brush then this all already we have seen magic eraser eraser tool this already we have discussed uh, a lot this gradient first i'll tell you about the paint bucket tool see i have a paint and this has painted the background means all the pixels adjoining pixels which are of similar similar uh, intensity so let me control z it and means undo it and this is a gradient tool let me show it again this paint see the similar thing you can just uh, cover and if i just change say background or foreground i can just change the tolerance value also say let me do it like this so the area will be less like this so now i'll just put these so the variation you can do right now this one is the gradient tool see there are various presets you can use these presets you can directly use it see i'm using it right and the area you want you can just i'm just clicking this area so this area is covered so this is a gradient there are various uh, options which are there for you you can try it so the brush tool and the pencil tool work like traditional uh, drawing tools applying color width brush strokes and the brush stroke is a basic painting tool it works like a traditional drawing tool by applying the color using these strokes the pencil tool is nothing more than the rip off uh, from the brush tool so it really consists of one pixel brush tool tip the mixer brush creates realistic painting techniques like mixing colors on the canvas combining colors on a brush and also varying paint wetness across a stroke the history uh, brush tool art history brush tool we have seen uh, this is to apply an image area from a different state or a snapshot to your current state this art history brush tool is an interesting variation on the plain old history brush tool and this both both tool paint over an image by using information from a previous state gradient and paint bucket also we have seen this gradient tool creates a gradual blend between multiple colors and you can choose from preset gradient fills or you can also create your own the paint bucket uh, tool fills an area of an image based on color similarity you can just click anywhere in the image and the paint bucket will fill an area around the pixel you clicked it has some tolerance value you can change so this is all about this chapter thank you so much and take care of yourself